everyone and welcome back to my channel. So welcome back for day three of Vlogmas. Today I'm going to be sharing with you my baby and toddler favorites for the month of October. So let's get started. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. So basically I have three favorites for each of the boys this month. Three favorites for Mackenzie, which is my three month old if you didn't know. And three favorites for Kaden, my two year old, almost three year old. Hi. Um, hi. Hi. <laughs> You're so cute. So I always start off with Kaden's favorites since he's the oldest. I find it appropriate and he's walking around here so I feel like he might steal his favorites. So my first favorite for Kaden, I actually mentioned in my toddler essentials or my toddler fall essentials video and it is sweatpants. Yep, just some plain old sweatpants. Caden has just been loving sweatpants. Honestly, if I try and put jeans on him right now, he gets upset because he wants to wear his sweat. So this truly is his favorite and not like mine. But I understand it's getting into the colder weather. Jeans are not as comfortable once it gets cold. You know, who wants to go outside in jeans? And plus, if you're just staying around home, who doesn't find sweats way more comfortable? So he has been loving sweatpants. Another one of Caden's favorites, or newfound favorites, is the show Paw Patrol. I don't know about you, is anybody else's kids obsessed with this show? We don't let Caden watch a lot of TV, but when we do, he always asks to watch Paw Patrol. Jessica, if you're watching, my sister, it's your fault. She introduced him to it once on Netflix, and now he's like obsessed. So I think Santa might be very kind this year and have to bring Caden some Paw Patrol toys because he's so obsessed with it right now. And the last favorite for Caden this month has been this turtle, I think I might have mentioned this when he was like a really little kid. It's a little bit beat up because it's been played with. But basically, Caden has been sleeping, going to bed in his room all by himself. It's kind of been a struggle. He's always gone in his room for the past like year and a half or whatever, or like almost two years. But he always needed us to sit with him until he fell asleep. But, but now he's becoming a big boy and he's just going to bed all by himself. I'm just so proud of him. But one thing he really loves to do before he goes to bed is we pull this out and basically what this does is you turn this on and it projects, you can see the light there, you can't see much else, but it projects stars and, moon, and a moon onto the ceiling in a certain color. So it has green and blue and orange and so you have the option. So we will put it on his desk and we will ask him what color do you want it to be tonight? So he gets to choose and we turn it on before bed and he just likes it. I guess it's just something fun for him. He gets to choose a different color every night and he's just really been loving this like sleep time turtle. I'm not sure what the name of it is, but, uh, but I'll find out for you. So moving on to Mackenzie's favorites, I have three for him. The first one is, and I'm gonna show this and then probably give it to him because he's gonna want it, is Sophie the Giraffe. Who doesn't love Sophie, honestly? My son loves Sophie. If you guys know and saw like my get ready with me random video, I talked about him teething and this is one thing he loves and really helps him with teething. He just loves like, what is it about Sophie that babies love so much? He just loves to gnaw on this and squeak it and it's just by far his favorite teething toy. Like by far, this is way worth the money. If you don't have one and you have a teething baby, buy it. I, I swear you, it's life changing. Another one, since Mackenzie's on my lap, and I was going to mention this anyways, is these bandana bibs. These ones are by Cute Kids. I just ordered them off of Etsy last year. You can see this is really wet. But it's doing its job. It's keeping his shirt from getting soaked. But because he's teething, he's drooling a lot. So I've been loving these bandana bibs because not only are they doing its job, they're super cute than the more typical bib. And like these are made more for drooling than eating, you know? Um, I did order some more though because I only have three and I find three is not enough. And I ordered some more from a different shop. So I'm hoping I'll like them too because they might be going in his stocking. The last favorite for Mackenzie is this little sleep sack here. I know I mentioned for my newborn must-haves where Aiden and Anae's receiving blankets. Well, obviously, he's kind of outgrown the swaddling stage, so he's upgraded to an Aiden and Anae's sleep sack, and it's just so cute. I love it because it's lightweight, so he's not gonna get too warm and hot and like stuffy, but it's still gonna keep him nice and cozy, and I find like wearing it, he sleeps longer because I think he feels like more warm and bundled. I don't know, I love it. And then because it like goes around the arms and zips up, you're not worried about it like going over their head or them like suffocating. It's just like a safe way of giving your baby a blanket. That is all for their favorites this month. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys like this video, please give it a big thumbs 
up so I know and I continue to do monthly favorites in the also, future. Also, if you're not already, please subscribe. You can subscribe by hitting the button in the top corner there or down there in the down bar. Also, please check out yesterday's video right over there, which was my favorites for the month of October. Other than that, that's all for this video. I love you guys to the moon and back, and I will see you in my next video. Mwah! Bye!